Minecraft Mentor here, and today we're going to be building the bottling machine from Immersive Engineering. So place down two sheet metal like this, one scaffolding, and then two light engineering blocks right there, scaffolding in front of them, then place down your redstone engineering block in the middle, and over here on the top layer, we're going to place down a fluid pump. Now, before you place your conveyor belts, you should know these are directional. They always have to go towards sheet metal on their way over to the light engineering blocks. You can reverse the engineering blocks with the uh, sheet metal, iron sheet metal, and that's going to be allow you to change the direction in which these go. So next, we just right click it with the hammer in the middle conveyor belt, and if everything worked, you will get your multi-block structure. A few things about this, it can be controlled with a redstone signal right here in front. To power this, we use a connector or an accumulator right on this orange dot like that. If you want to input liquids, it is either either one of these ports work. We're going to import it from there. And uh, let's turn on our export from this tank here. You can see it's filling up with liquid in its little buffer right here. If we grab a hopper or a conveyor belt works, we're going to use a hopper for it. Toss in some buckets and it's automatically going to fill the buckets with creosote for you. Some liquids actually take bottles like potions. You can bottle potions with this machine, which is really cool too, but we're using it for creosote and it just imports here, exports there, and you could use a chest or conveyor belt, any type of thing like that to pick up the items. And uh, that's it for this one. If you found it helpful, like, comment, subscribe.